grease is here? Is it just this stuff over here? Yeah. 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 Decrease the uh, shaft because we're going to rely on the O ring to actually yeah. transmit the drive and, and make the seal. So, if we've got any um, grease on there, it can slip. So, we use a special evaporator to lubricate the shaft to find the uh, seal on. It's evaporated. <laughs> it's cool. <laughs> really fast here. I don't use anything on it. But... <laughs> He's going to write the work instruction for this. Why well, he's really excited, look. <laughs> 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 Just bear in mind, James. It's got fun as well. Well, So different to the 38 BC, we've got this tapered shaft between the two um, shaft diameters. So we wouldn't normally, but on this particular occasion, we put an O-ring at the top and the bottom to make sure that either one or both actually seal the shaft because we weren't sure where it would land on the taper. So by spanning it, we've got um, double protection along the shaft. So the procedure is quite simple, as you can see, degrease the shaft, put the evaporating oil on, spread it around, slide the seal into position, then we tighten up the catalytic bolts to hold it to the casing first, that's the first step, and then the second step is to do these grubs up. And I'll the timings then. Yeah. Your, well, they set the working length of yeah. the faces within the seal. So, so what we have here is we have a rotary face here yeah. and a stationary face, and these springs actually push them together and generate the closing forces. Because you've got no pressure in here whatsoever, you've got nothing to assist mm. the seal yeah. to actually keep the faces together. So the springs do that. But what we want to make sure is that they're in the correct position. So. If, for instance, um, the, there were no springs there, but there'd be no way of ensuring that the faces are always touching. Sorry, wrong phrase. They're together. They don't yeah. touch because what we have is a yeah. fluid film between them. Yeah. Uh, so the springs ensure that that's there um, all the time. If that gap is allowed to get too big, no seal. There's no seal. Yeah. That's it. And if they get too close together, you'll burn the seal out very So once that's locked up, you'll remove them. And that's. Then ready to run. 